I just uh, got this little Sony UX570 and I'm giving it a little go to uh, start recording Chris cast again, but doing it in a much more uh, fluid way. So when I'm out and about taking a walk or working remotely, I can just uh, start recording and then upload it and then compile it every eight minutes into a little episode. So please, I look forward to seeing how well this particular recording thing works and if I'm holding it in the right way or if I should point it at my face or if I can just hold it like this or if I shouldn't touch it because that makes noise or what. Anyway, this is, this is, these are my first words and cars are going by and I'm in a park. I'm in, uh, an area of South Arlington that, uh, is off of Walter Reed Drive and is a community center and tennis courts and basketball courts. And I just got to see my very first pickleball in the wild two adorable young women were playing it and they had to set up their um their net and it was very cool i get very gender envious when i see any woman in a cute little tennis outfit a little little white skirt and a tank top and little tennis shoes because in a different world in a different size and a different gender I'd totally rock those. <laughs> and I say that not mockingly. I say that with great appreciation and envy. Anyway. Um, oh, apparently uh, there are open games every day at 9 a.m. at the community center, right, where they were playing. And it's pickup, and they will teach me how to play pickleball. So I told them if I lose a little bit of weight, I would love to take up tennis and pickleball. I think that would be very fun. Anyway, this is the end of the first uh, segment, and I'll start soon. I really don't know if I can maintain or persist doing a uh, podcast. So I am going to just collect thoughts as they come. I'm going to be similar to those silly archetypes that uh, existed in my college life whenever I visited Georgina and Fiona Marr at uh, NYU Tisch School. I would go uh, with, uh, with a friend or I'd go with Georgina to a to a deli or to a diner and we'd sit there and there'd be someone there who had a pearl quarter and they were dictating into it like I am now saying the sun is yellow the sky is blue the moon is white and gray the moon smiles at me and all those other kinds of silly things and now that's actually what I'm doing. I'm going to be carrying this little Sony UX570 voice quarter with me with uh, the understanding that I'm not going to ever get to the point where I have a proper mic or a noise guard or uh, am I going to do much of anything except maybe because I do have uh, audio editing I might uh, normalize it, or I might compress it, but that's just about it. Otherwise, I'm just going to collect these kinds of things. Um, keep on recording up until late minutes and then publish without a lot of context. Maybe down the line I'll have themes. Maybe I'll actually have eight minutes of the same topic stuff. Or maybe I'll go over and under eight minutes. It really doesn't matter. Uh, I was talking to my best friend, Mark Harrison, and he suggested that I I do the Quibbly or Quibby or whatever that new streaming service is that contains its episodes to eight minutes. 
I think I'll try to aim for eight minutes per episode and then upload them as I record them, as I download them, as I edit them, and as I publish them. And I plan to use or continue using Anchor.fm for that sort of thing. If you wonder where I am, I'm at a community park in South Arlington off of Columbia Pike uh, near the community center and I'm sitting at a green painted wooden picnic table. Uh, There's little kids playing football slash soccer, foosball, and the little kids are screaming and yelling and being happy. There's at least three or four dogs being walked. There are several people on on uh, relaxing on uh, on beach blankets or, uh, or towels, enjoying the day. There's one lady in shades, black short shorts, and a white tank top who's just relaxing up against an oak tree. Um, I'm sitting, and to my right, there is a tennis court. Nobody's playing at the moment, and in front of me, there is a basketball court, and to my, uh, to my, uh, two o'clock, to my one o'clock, there is the community center, and I don't think there's anything there for me until I get a little bit older, uh, so it makes me feel like 50 is still young. Um, I guess there's really not anything for anybody now that there's the quarantine. So, there's that. And I'm close enough to a road that you probably hear cars go by. I really don't know what the filtering is of this recording. Like I said, I've never heard anything from it yet. So, please give me feedback as to how all this sounds. I hope you can hear the birds tweeting. I hope you can't hear too much wind. I hope you hear a little bit of ambiance. And I hope you enjoy that.